Imagine it's Monday morning and your inbox is overwhelming with unread emails. Your team is asking for updates, HR is sharing new policies, and you are scrambling to find the latest project plan in a maze of folders. Sounds familiar, right? That's exactly what we were facing at our company just a few months ago. Chaos, miscommunications, missed deadlines. The real struggle is our team was spread across multiple tools. Slack for chatting, emails for announcements, share drive for documentations and project trackers like Jira. But none of it felt connected. Important informations would slip through the cracks and people spent hours just trying to find the right file or update. It was frustrating to see the least. Everyone was doing their best but without a centralized space. It felt like we were running in a circles. Then Atlassian come up with the Confluence company hub which is a turning point and honestly it sounded too good to be true at first. A single place to organize everything but we decided to give it a shot. We started small creating a space in Confluence and adding few pages like announcements, team directory and ongoing projects and something incredible happened slowly. The chow started this appeal. So today we are diving into one of my favorite tools for Teams collaborations, which is Confluence, and showing you how to create a company hub that keeps everyone on the same page. If you are looking for ways to align your teams, improve communications, and centralize your company's knowledge, this video is for you. So don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe if you love content like this. It really helps the channel grow and keeps me motivated to bring you more tech topics. To navigate it to Company Hub, you need to have the premium accounts. It is not available for the free versions. So here you will see Company Hub page is visible where you can see headers, all the Company Hub related informations like announcements, Town Hall in next week, performance reviews, employee shoutouts or resources, quick links, everything you can see it at one place. So first of all, what is Company Hub? So Company Hub is essentially your one-stop shop for all your organizations. Important informations. Think of it as your virtual office bulletin board, but better. Here is an example of what we will build today, a clean organized Hub with everything your team needs at their fingertips. How to set it up? Basically, you have to navigate it to the screen where you will see hub settings. Here, you can do customizations where you can edit the hub very quickly. If you want, you can add header image or you can select it from this repository. I'm just changing it. You can see it quickly. Even if you'll realize if you don't have to apply it, you can do it. Or after that, if you wanted to upload images, you can do it quickly. Recently, our channel reached 26 million views and uploaded this video. After that, if you want to make the changes in the titles, you can easily do it. Here, I'm adding Riker Kul as a title. In the announcement page, you'll also have options. If you want, you can remove it else. In the carousel sections, you can do the editing. And these editing appears at right hand side. You can change the image color. If you want, even you can make the changes of title like system updates on 27th, where some of the server won't accessible for couple of hours. If you want, you can add detailed descriptions here, attach the image or if required, you can remove it. 
You can also customize the length as well. If you feel that this should look like full length, you can also do it. If you want to do the copy, you can immediately do it from this page. Removal option is also available where by using this pen, you can remove it. If you wanted to take the help of AI, you can also take suggestions from them and use it. Once your carousel is updated, you have to just move it out and that's it. Similarly, you can also add other items or other cards like Click on add it and you will have this options. If you wanted to add a new card, you can add it. Add the link where you want it to integrate with your Jira. You have to just add the link and that link will be added successfully. Post that, you can just save it and whenever you will click on this, it will navigate it to the that page. Once you will publish it, this company hub page will be published and you will see the company hub available here you can see announcement employee shoutouts if you want similar way you can add the cards even you can add it images magnify images or you can use customizations so this is a very quick enough where we can add as much as items available at any point of time, you realize I want to add performance reviews are you. In this wizard, you have to just click on add it. And from the edit sections, you can add this added. And from here, you can add the link. This link will be added. And whenever anyone wants to see it, they can quickly navigate it to this page and just click on this link. It will have the updates available. We have added the link on this page. Whenever I will click on that link, it will navigate to that page to me. Similar way, whenever you wanted to make the changes in into a hub settings, you can easily do it. Now let me close it and go to the hub settings. Even we can have a look on how many views we have on the regular basis and who is the administrator history, rename, or deactivate anything we want, we can do it. Analytics option is also available where you will see the total count of views, unique counts, clicks, clicks to rate, and views. By this way, you will be able to understand who is actually using your company hub and how it is regularly used, what is the strength, and what all percentage people are liking this product. And uh, even here we can see the permission scheme where you can add particular set of users who wanted to view on this page. Even if, if required, you can add your company logo in this sections. Easily, this will be available at any point of time. You wanted to share feedback about this, you can easily share it. And if it is required in the added sections, you can even add macros. Let's consider I wanted to add some macro or text. We can easily add it. If you wanted to upload images directly from here, you can even add it. And this image will be added successfully. If you want, even we can record this via loom. We can easily add widgets like to-do list, integrate to-do list like Slack for quick updates. A cool feature is the ability to embed calendars or link Jira projects directly into your hub. This ensures everyone stay on sync. To keep our hub engaging, scheduling regular updates like weekly announcements or employee spotlights, it helps keeping the space alive and relevant. Let's understand real world use cases for using company hub. First use case is HR can share onboarding materials and policies. Team can showcase their project timelines. Leadership can post updates or vision statements. So that's all from the real time use cases. So that's it. A well designed company hub on Confluence can transform the way your team communicates and collaborates. I would love to hear your plan to use your hub. Drop your ideas in the comments below. And what do you think about this new features 
coming in conference. If you have any queries or questions, always reach out to me. I will be happy to answer it. And because this is a new features, you might expect less functionality or less customizations, but in upcoming release, you can expect a lot more from this. And that's all. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more content like this. I post regular videos on Atlassian products. It will be easy for me or it will be better for me or my channel to grow based on your outputs. That's all from today. We'll see you in next part of the video. Till then, happy learning.